it's kind of the excitement level um, of the team going into into Pac-12 and maybe kind of a new season, a fresh start for you guys. Yeah, I think it's a we're really excited coming in because you know we got three three games on the road and and especially I'm excited for the Seattle one to get to go back home and you know see a lot of my family be there. So that's going to be a really fun exciting experience. You guys are starting to shoot better. Do you kind of feel like you're past the adjustment period? New coach, getting new confidence. Are you, are you guys just kind of out there playing now? Yeah, I think we, you know, we've come to gel a lot more, and I think that showed in the last couple of games as we've come out to better starts and you know played a lot better, and it's transitioned into you know into, into wins. Do you think Pac-12 play will be a little more a better assessment of your growth as a player you know, against a little better competition? Yeah, I think you know going against you know consistent guys every single in every single game and our day in the Pac-12 is. Is uh, is going to be an adjustment because you know it's not as much in the, the non-conference season, so I think it's going to it's going to test me a little bit more. But I think I can you know show what what my capabilities are. And we'll see one of the better big men in the conference uh, when you guys play Stanford with Stefan Nastic. Mm -hmm. What do you what do you know about him? Are you excited for that chance to, to match up with him? Yeah, I mean, he's a you know he's a he's a pretty big bruiser in there. He's skilled and you know he can he can shoot a little bit in the mid range. So it should be a fun experience playing against him because. You know he's gonna he's gonna test you and and uh, get you ready for the rest of the Pac-12 as well. Josh, you've been putting up a pretty consistent 15 and 10 in the non-conference schedules, but are are you kind of excited to see if you can keep that up against uh, you know, these bigger name programs? Yeah, I think you know that's gonna be you know something I'm striving to do is just get rebounds and you know do whatever I can to help help the team help the team win and you know pretty much whatever whatever I can do. More than likely, you'll have a bigger target on your back than when you did to start the season. Do you change your game at all when teams know more about you or anything like that, or is it just the same consistency? Uh, I think it's just try to stick to you know within what, what I can do. I'm not going to try to do too much, you know, four shots or do something that I'm not really used to do. But I'm just going to you know, just try to do me pretty much. Is it kind of liberating when uh, when Jordan's? Playing well in the post, like he has these last couple games. You maybe noticed in that last game, uh, that you had a few more, a little bit more open on some range stuff. Yeah, definitely. I think Jordan and Q are pretty much the X factors with our team. You know, Q opening it up from the outside, and then Jordan, you know, just banging down low um, and scoring inside is gonna be a big key. You know, if we have they have two guys going in on Jordan, you know, it opens up the court for shooters on the outside. Same thing for Q, they're going to have to, you know, help more and respect respect his shots so he can drive and, you know, kick for open shooters as well. You had a chance to really look at the Pac-12 so far, and if you have, how would you assess the conference um, in the non-conference uh, season, I guess? Yeah, I've got to watch a... I've got to watch a lot of games, you know, Pac-12 Network, and uh, you know it's it's gonna be t another tough season. You know, there's there's a lot of really good teams, so I'm looking forward to the challenge. You guys haven't been particularly good on the road so far in the, the non-conference. What do you guys do to, to kind of change that and um, get better away from home? Uh, I think the you know biggest key is coming out to a fast start. On the road, we've come out to you know some pretty slow starts, and it's you know pretty hampered. It's hampered us because we've you know haven't really been able to come back from that, and you know it's transitioned to you know a loss. So. Got a little blood on your jersey. Are they some pretty good physical practices? Uh, yeah, we've been working hard the last couple of days. You know, we've been emphasizing it, you know trying to teach ourselves and you know really really talk more on the floor, whether it's offense or defense, so we can you know you know go to away games. You know, there's gonna be a, a lot of loud crowds, so you know, getting a lot of energy from within.